from Bexu. That's right. Starting this off, yeah. we need to see if Bexu can have, uh, first of all, a, a good first two rounds because they certainly were cleaner at that phase of the game than they were the rest of the game. So they need to have a strong starting point. Uh, Viper Wall going to dice up showers here, making a, a push in there a little bit more complicated. So often we do have duels over the orb here. And so it's going to be uh, the Jet coming in here to try to take that. Pay with the Sheriff here trying to control uh, B Long as Anox has done a few quick peeks here, hopping peeks. Doesn't quite get him. Backs up, reloads, repositions. Anox peeking once again. Pay still trying to shoot him as he shoulder peeks. <laughs> Gonna make him use up all the bullets. It's a great strat, Anox. Yeah. So here, let me show you how to repeatedly peek. Not that. Oh hey, my god. Nice shot there from Kosa. Yeah. Takes down oh. Pei. <laughs> Levy taking a lot of damage right there. Jojo in the U-Haul. Waiting for them to come through. And a storm going out. Yeah, they not hard to dodge that. back up here. But this is going to give them time to plant the spike without interruptions here. Yeah, Levy gets the plant. He is very low. Wow is low as well, but a great shot around the corner into Halbe's head. Yeah, a bit of a trade there. Cobra going to try to come around the corner here, and a beautiful flash there. Cobra getting that kill easily. Levy falls, and it is getting worse and worse here as everyone goes down. You can see here they're going to trade that off. Definitely the two agents you want to have to try to get that defuse to build up uh, towards your alties here. Hmm. And, you know, I think a very... Uh, a bit of a relief here, even at the start here for Go and Go Prince, uh, crushing in that pistol round. Yeah, yeah, and that that doesn't make me feel like Bexu is going to have a very good shot, right? If that was four of their seven wins were pistol rounds. If you lose the first one, you probably are losing the second. So how many wins do we have now? No, I, I completely agree. Before I choked and coughed to death there. Um, coronavirus! <laughs> <laughs> no, I choked on my water. Um, basically, uh, yeah, that was not a good showing from them back there. And... Um, we're going to have a pop flash here from Kosa. Comes out. Ooh. Oh, now the idea was good. The execution, not so much. And so one Spectre goes to the other side here. A, a little victory that couldn't make for a big second round win here. Yeah, look at this Hmong just inside the smoke. Oh, he might really surprise the Nox. The Nox actually pulls back. Wow goes ahead and plants. Sitting the L drone through there. He's trying to confirm if there's anybody actually that's his neighbor oh, right now. Oh, sick shock pull right at the feet of Cobra. Okay, it's Cobra in. almost gets killed by that next shot ball here. So right quick him down there. Last pack thrown in. Tries to come around the corner. Pay getting a couple kills. All right. Now it's just a Nox. Right. Nox gets one. Can he find two more? No, was not checking that tight angle there on the box. Got shot in the back. And I'll tell you what, this really all comes back to that pop flash there with the sky, mm -hmm. giving that specter up. Um, so you lose a weapon in that whole process. And then there's an opening at the B site. They were able totally. to carry that in there. They were able to control that. And so that's a big and important win here for Bexu. Yeah, very well done to win that second pistol round when you lost the first. Showing their prowess at those early rounds, but will they be able to hang on to that? Are they gonna like if they can take round three and four? Okay, we got a real match on our hands, you know. Yeah, well, you know, of course, the early parts of a Valorant match always uh, ripple on into the later parts. So again, it's the start of what could be something pretty amazing. We got Cobra once again on the Marshall. See if they keep peeking against it. Ooh, Cobra taking, or Kosa taking some damage there through the box. Blebby coming up B short. So Blebby taking peaks. Right now, this sky is actually perched up on a, on a box in the very corner of B. They don't have a raise over there to try to flush her out. Coming around the corner, Kosa gonna get yep. taken down by Meng Hoon. Very good, identifying where he was at. Yeah, it should be noted this is a pretty heavy save round here for Go and Go. Oh, beautifully done. Jojo does get that kill in return, but um, they are gonna get the spike planted. I have to imagine this should be a pretty easy closer, uh, denying yeah. any pushing from elbow or door. I mean, Cobra has the Marshall, Halbe has no shields and the classic. So, I mean, I think we'll see them try to get in here and get something done, but you can't imagine much is gonna happen. Yeah, he takes him down. Hey, Cobra with another kill. 
Oh, Cobra just completely tearing the face yeah. off of Pei before Bung Hoon ends the round. Two to one. Yeah, nice, nice kills there at the end from Cobra. But now we enter this moment where we're going to have Phantoms and Vandals here. And, and that's what I'm excited to see here. Um, I'm very much curious as, as to how uh, Bexu's going to handle a, a game where, you know, in the previous map, Prince dominated so hard that we barely as, heard yeah. any victories at all. As soon the as they, side. as soon as they had a full buy round, it was it was Prince all the way. We'll see if that is, uh, is how it continues. Yeah, they got what they want. Anox actually already has the AWP. Look at this. Peeking down B long. Ooh. They're gonna set up that recon bolt. Hey, right around the okay, corner. Kosa wants to do another pop flash here. And, oh! And Pei returns fire. Nicely done. Whiffing that shot there too from Anox. Fortunately for them, JoJo is really holding down window mm. with ease. Yeah, Nox trying to come in here with the owl. Gets shot down. Lear going out. Yeah, interesting Chocolate. exchange of abilities <laughs> yeah, here. Yeah. Pay's going to have to flee to the other side of the map as they're getting ready to spring onto A. It is a three versus four, but only two players here to defend at the A site. I'll be seeing Blebby. Uh, Blebby, rather, uh, coming out of the baths there. Does pop out. Getting that plant. Albe, not sure where it is, tries to uh, wall bang the box, but it's actually planted over by uh, U Haul. So they, going out. they can basically confirm that there's nobody over by box. They can start to focus their sights on other parts here. Are they going to actually. Okay, this is a great use of showstopper here. Yeah, it just backs up from all that. Alarm bot and nano swarm. Knox here with the op ready. They do manage to clear showers. Mm -hmm. Jojo with okay, four they do kills it. now. My God, cleans that up rather quickly. And Nox gonna get the defuse. Good enough. All right, yep. so that's the first full by rifle round. Yeah, and, and it and goes to go win. Though. Beautifully done. And uh, we want to wait. You know, now now that we're getting into more close to the middle uh, of the first half here, how well will Prince perform? Because even when they seem to be in a pretty precarious situation, they usually pull through. And again, a lot of this comes down, not to the end, but to the start where JoJo controlled yeah. the, the flow through window. Uh, and they had to, yeah. yeah, they had to improvise with an a site plant instead. Mm -hmm. All right, once again, the op here for Anok. Anox is sitting in B long. Kosa with the judge just inside a hookah. Mung Hoon coming up. Munghoon, I mean, it can be a little bit tough for him to really check what's in there, but he does have Sova right at his back. Here comes the owl. Gets shot down from outside, so that kind of, uh, yeah, that that allows Kosa to stay hidden, and he uh. gets the Munghoon kill, but Banba gonna take him down. Yeah, every time the first step towards... Oh! oh! They finally did it! But it was a Nox, not Cobra, so it's still what I said stands. Jojo coming around this corner. Uh, actually, once again, JoJo is the king of B. And this is going to bounce that omen back across the map with the spike as they're going to try to come in here and infiltrate A. Cobra with a pretty nice angle over here. Outside of showers, able to cover mm -hmm. most of this, unless there's a push in there. Oh, hold on. That was a big mistake. The moment yeah. that he went into uh, set up Astro. I was going to say, did we just switch? Oh, no, that's him. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Why? <laughs> It's a rough one. Yeah, a little so bit of a, it was a shot there. he should have been able to take, but yeah, you know, yeah. that's one of the dangers of you know being the, the controller when you're trying to set up these smokes is that you're sort of outside of the game in a sense. Okay, WoW's got a pretty good angle to completely blindside them. Okay, shot from behind. Yeah. Gets that strong kill right there. Levy with the flank as well. WoW clutches that at the end. Um, as you know, the few times we have seen big wins here from Bexu, so it is WoW really mm -hmm. taking control there at the end of that game. But again, WoW was pretty smart really with how he hid behind the box and stayed quiet enough. They thought they had cleared that angle and he sort of deftly maneuvered behind that and mm -hmm. then set up that dark cover, or yeah. uh, paranoia, excuse me. Yeah, JoJo definitely having another strong round there as well, playing very well for his team here. Flank so so important. 
Yeah, pretty beautifully done, to be honest with you. All right, this is a pretty big save round right now. So you see Go and Go is actually pushing pretty aggressively here. Let's see if they can make anything happen. Jojo uh, navigating that poison wall pretty nicely. There does manage to fend off A from the attacker's side. Uh, Blebby comes around and gets Cobra, who already took some damage from that shock bolt. Yeah, I'll tell you what, Gongo Prince having a much harder uh, overall uh, second game here. Yeah. I mean, it's, it seems like... Uh, nice to see. Bex is really stabilized. <laughs> nice shot there. Again, JoJo is really clutching so far in this game. Mm -hmm. Anytime they're looking weak, JoJo reminds us that you got to really appreciate what a strong team this is. Meanwhile, JoJo takes out a uh, WoW. Yeah, we the didn't catch that action. in the game so far. That's right. JoJo with some paint shells comes across here. Kosa's still left as well. Only pay at full health. Kosa able to grab a gun. Um, and this is going to be a plant over onto B. Uh, and it should be a pretty manageable game here. They did send the sky through teleporter. Mm. Can be a bit tough <laughs> when you have one in teleporter because there's, it's not like there's some surprise. I guess right now he does not know. Yeah, he did open the door and then back up and nobody was looking. So you could be led to believe that somebody's actually outside of teleporter right mm -hmm, now. Mm -hmm. And I guess they just want to go for the exit frag? Because there's no way they can get this defuse yeah. off in time. Yeah, I think you're quite right. That's what's happening. Yo, yeah. Is Kosa going to have the star sense here? Oh, wow. That's insane. And he actually doesn't even peek. So it looks like that was just the hiding spot Yeah, for Kosa. I mean, look, they're going to carry the weapon into the next round. With Bexu beginning to take a further lead, I think they have to be smart about when they do want to have a save round versus mm -hmm. not. And you know, Gongo Prince really being tested a little bit more this time. They are. They are. But there's so much more uh, to come here with rounds. It, it could still be quite a reversal, but I got to say, I'm pleasantly surprised here by Bexu. No, they're, they're playing very, very well. We haven't really seen Gongo -Go, uh, pick it up yet. There was one pistol round win, and then the, the first rifle round win, and that's it. Let's see what they can do now. Anox going back into that off. So they're going to use the Viper's Pit to basically make a not so much of an enticing place to push into. Yeah, A short specifically looking pretty tough. Knox with that op, just kind of staring down, getting wide a single. You really can from up there. Pay though, not peeking yet. Look at this. Ready to throw that bird out. Sky arches are back almost too much. Like, like, that's what we call her good posture her front, cases. Her front looks like my back. Yeah. <laughs> when I play games. Oh, oh and that's a sick. Oh, yeah, that was a sick shot. So Pei peaks a little bit too much and pays the price. We've got Cobra up here. Now he's spotted. They go for the wall bang. Mm. Doesn't really get him, to be honest. Yeah. Banba, though, still going to try to him. follow that one up. Yep, Cobra out of the picture now with that kill. Seekers are coming out across. Are they, they're going to try to traverse uh, this area anyways. They're going to get in through showers. Thanks to this lockdown. Okay. Kind of negating the functionality of that Viper's Pit. Jojo is insane. Yeah. Just nuked WoW. It's another very strong kill. Kosa falls to Munghoon, though. Takes out the turret. Spike continues to tick. How are they approaching? Going towards baths. Ooh, oh, on the oh. Nox yeah, this is a tough over one. here. He knows where he is. Yeah, I don't think there's anything left here. Yeah, that's going to be it. Yep. And uh, the fifth win here, Bexu really bringing it, man. Yeah, you see WoW clapping. I think it was a pretty discouraging first round. Uh, you know, the difference between this best of three and the one previous is, is that uh, Bexu, you know, even though they've lost the first map, they do seem to be very adaptive as the game flows on. Mm -hmm. It just seems like they're, they're just playing straight up a better game here. I, I wonder what it is exactly, because we're still, it, it doesn't feel like Gongo is necessarily playing poorly. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. They're definitely falling back a lot on the uh, same positioning. That's one thing I guess I can say. Anox in that B-long once again. 
Doesn't really have anything, though. It's a pretty hard save. He's he's sporting the classic right now. Yeah, no, this is an expected lost round here for the defender's side. They're really invested in the future. Yeah, just some shoulder peeking going on. Here's that owl coming in. Tries to get a shock on the place where the uh, driver of the owl drone would be. Yeah. Love to see it. In fact, it does work. <laughs> it, it hit Bonbon. So yeah. It's kind of nice. Blebby in here with Pei in the bats. Can we go ahead and pick that up? It's to refill so. immediately for the lockdown. We've got uh, Bonba coming back here to retrieve the spike. Nox trying to run away. Ooh, a nice jump. Oh, yeah. my God. We've seen this so many times where uh, you know the, the uh, recon bolt is used as a bait mm -hmm. or it's used like uh, from the other side, I mean, you know, where yeah, he says, yeah. no, I don't care if that scans me. I'm just going to shoot you as you come out. Um, and so we're seeing what appears to be the beginning to the end of this round is there's one more player remaining here. Cobra. Uh, at times, the best player on the team, but certainly not good enough to make any kind of a comeback. Six to two as the uh, gap is getting wider here as far as the score goes. Yeah, it's actually really surprising, I think, in a lot of ways after watching that first map to see Bexu fight so strongly here against Prince. Definitely, uh, you know, Kosa seems to not be delivering so far. Cobra not quite as strong as he was that last time. Yeah, and I mean a dominating Bexu round, just but playing better overall. An unexpected result here with the pistol round. I think yeah. if they are going to turn it around, it has to be in this next round. Yes. Um, if they can bring it back six to six, they're good to go. Yeah. I think still. So. They've got a knocks of the op. Everybody else, phantoms or vandals. Mm -hmm. Okay, Mung Hoon, poking up through B long. We have that toxic screen up going through B. Oh, oh, wrong time to draw your weapon out there. Yeah, that was a tough one for Kosa. It was weird because they were both moving at the same time, so they almost rotated out of each other's views. But to then draw that weapon, I think it was a surprise to see that anybody was over there. Ooh, some big damage comes out there with the paint shells on Among Whom. Has to back up. Tailwind saving most of his health. Going through teleporters now as the Omen Smokes are going to block off uh, one half of A here. They could try to push through showers in A uh, short. Try to take control of this. Throws down the recon bolt to try to utilize with his off and through the smoke. Can't quite get it. Pay hey, taking down Cobra. Uh, Jojo so far playing better than the rest of his teammates here. Um, they've thinned out the numbers. It's a two versus two. Anox is up here in A heaven, but he can't find a really good angle. So if Jojo's not able to, to, to manage this well, there's not going to be a lot they can do. They flushed out. Uh, the Killjoy, who's now Rome pulled under here. Oh, ah, that was insane. Yeah. Anox is so good. Now the only thing they have to deal with is showers. They do that. They get the defuse, and they start the comeback. Okay, okay. I was a little bit worried there, especially with the good smoking. Anox tried to use his recon bolt to still utilize his op from up in heaven there. Right. But, I mean, they all hit around the corners. They knew what was up. It felt like they were controlling the situation. But still... In comes Go and Go Prince and breaks them open. Pretty brave move there from Anox to slip down from A Heaven with the classic. You have to rely on the triple shot burst to the head yeah, yeah. if you're going to win that. But he pulled it off. They got control and were able to then manage the shower position. Now Go and Go Prince calls for a tactical timeout, and I like the moment that they used to to take advantage of this because yeah. they did get the win, but it was not easy. Mm -hmm. That was not a game where it was simply everybody on A doing their job and everybody on B doing theirs. Mm -hmm. That was them being able to think on their feet and basically, honestly, if JoJo is not playing like a killer, they would not win a single round here. That is very um, true. JoJo has been better than the rest of his team easily, whereas last round on Haven, like everyone was actually playing quite well on the yeah, team. It, yeah. was, it was very much a team effort, but, but here JoJo is the Lawrence of we, Prince. We saw Costa at the start of that flip out a gun yeah, right here and just die, yeah. insta-die. I yeah. mean, a strong team, especially on defender's side, is going to do everything in their power to hold every angle. And we don't really have rounds like that here. So I think that tactical pause, they're very important as, you know, go and go needs to really st try to cement this lead and keep that synergy with their teammates in the, in the areas they're trying to cover here as we get into the uh, later part of the first half. Mm. Three rounds left, and they definitely want to pick up as many as is possible. Kosa, shoulder peeking out of the garden there. Jojo behind the box, op up on top of that crate, doesn't quite get the connection. Munghoon looking up B long. 
Kosa's had a hard time holding this area. Like, in, you know, in theory, Sky is very good over here. Kosa, able to make it work. Recon Volt gets shot out. Yeah, pop flash there, but Kosa pulls back. Again, Kosa was the weak link in the last round, not able to control B long. Lebby trying to infiltrate into A now. Smoke's going up absolutely everywhere. Anox readies his shock bolt. Cobra sits here and waits. Yeah, with the Leer out, he is uh, just waiting around that corner with the judge. And tries to push in and absolutely backfires with a headshot from Pei. Uh, as they're beginning to squeeze the A site a little bit further. Ooh, even JoJo's taken out by Banba. Yeah, it's just one after one after one. Prince is slowly getting mowed down here. Kosa trying to get a good angle here. Uh, Anox needs to rely on Kosa being able to control the ground area here. A peak here. They can't get that off shot from that distance. Pei is just clutching it right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. Pei has really turned it on for his team. Seems like Anox wants to try to get another pick here. Beautifully done. Does get... Uh, that an extra kill off here, but oh. is ultimately shut down by Munghun. Yeah, that's that's pretty painful to lose the op at the last few seconds. Running around that corner just a little bit too quickly. I'll tell you what, man, I'm really digging Bexu. These guys yeah. are a very good team. You can see why they've gotten this far. I know in Season 3 we've got a lot of new faces here mm -hmm. uh, competing, but these guys have played extremely well. Now, we only have one more round in the first half. You know, the difference between a 9 to 3 or an 8 to 4 is huge. Yeah, you, you're feeling a lot better that other way. Yeah, it's. But here's the thing I actually kind of want it to go 9 to 3. I, I want to see Bex who really fight back and push these guys to the brink. Let's see who wins in a map 3. But yeah. It's not quite so easy, right? That switch of sides could screw up everything for them. All right, Bex who now. They're taking it a little bit slow. Pay here with that op. Kosa's taken a very forward position. You might, you would not expect a Sky to, to be here. And part of what Anox is doing is acting like he's the only player covering this, mm -hmm. so that there's a chance that there's a push up into B long and Sky can hit from the other side. Yeah. But uh, I don't know if it's going to work. I mean, they, they have to commit to B long in order for this little tactic to pay off. Viper Wall slices up the A site once more. Oh, and that Kosa actually takes down Pei, who had that op. So that's that's a little bit painful for sure. I think it's not really possible to get that gun back right now. Munghoon shooting from Baz. Oh, Ooh, Cobra Joe almost gets yeah. him as he tries to walk off while reloading. Nick in the back of Munghoon's head mm. before he manages to get away. Here we go. Halbay waiting around the corner here with the sheriff. Don't forget, this is a big save round right now for Go and Go, so yeah. if they're able to take it down. Well, they've dropped one. If they can maybe get one more, I think it's absolutely doable. Ooh, almost gets Blebby. Definitely takes some damage there. Uh, and they're just going to be able to come in here and dive onto the A site. Looks like it's going to be a plant outside of Tube. Hunter's Fury with a great interrupts. Oh! Anox is insane. JoJo gets the kill there. There's not enough time. They can't get the plant in time. The fourth. Wow, just barely. Too. That was so huge. close. So close. So we go into the last uh, round now. Again, seven to five, man. If they can pull that back up, mm. it's going to be huge. I mean, that, that you're almost even there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'll tell you, man. That, that's a clutch play because that was the round that, you know, you hope for a win. It's a sheriff buy, but mm -hmm. you know your chances aren't very good. And everybody here on Go and Go Prince did their job. Yeah, yeah, definitely the case. But and again, a Nox there with the deny just at the very end. They just barely couldn't plant. Yeah. It's a great way to abuse the time. They really knew exactly where that spike was going to be planted. We've got WoW now with the uh, Odin. Absolutely. Nox. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Shows that he has the op once again in B-Long. Munghoon looking to pop in here. Oh! Oh, that was sick. That was a nice shot onto Kosa. I tell you, Kosa had a really good game on Haven, but he is he's having a hard time here on Vine. All right, Wild going to plant. Looking for that eighth round win. Oh, here we go. Hunter's Fury coming back out. Oh, they're playing oh, so well. Just crushing. Bexu's just dominating here. Yeah. 
mean, they have all, all the, uh, you know, utility to spare here. Anox puts up again another incredible fight, but ultimately it comes down to 8-4, and Bexy was going to win this unless Gongo -Go Prince can have an even more commanding presence mm. uh, here in the side switch. Yeah, well, I think it's still very doable here for Go and Go. It seemed like they didn't really get their feet under them. It was kind of funny because they won that first pistol round, which felt like it was heralding a big victory for them, yeah. but unable to hold on even through the rifle rounds that we saw them dominate uh, on Haven. So as we go into the side switch, you think Go and Go can come back or are we going to go to map three? I think it's going to be tough. I think we're going to have a much better idea uh, just a few rounds in here because... Mm -hmm. Uh, you know, bind can be tricky. Some teams, they really struggle on that attacker side. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Let's see. All right, so go and go on the attack here. A couple frenzies and a shorty. Boosting okay. forward here with that shorty. Wants to get right in. Oh, oh my God. He's so low. So low! It's 2 HP! Yeah. The 2 HP is still enough to kill off a whole team. Yeah. Oh, Kosa taking a ton of damage there from the Nano Swarm as well. Five health himself. We need a knife fight. All right, so they haven't... Well, they're actually going all the way through the spawn. This is insane. They're going to go through B. Mm. This is so funny. But already? Yeah. Yeah, look, we actually had Mungkun come around through the teleporter, so... They had an idea that this could occur, at least. Yeah. I think it's going to be tough here for Munghoon. Look at the positions they're taking just yeah, at the Yeah, they got a shorty window. pointed right oh, up there. that's the place right there. <laughs> it's the scumbag location. Uh, Come on, let's go. Uh, oh, oh, tries to back up, gets picked off. Oh, Bexu's got this. Yeah, Bexu's got it. this. Only Cobra left over here. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> there's just no too way. Too many, too many. That was... That was sick, though. I like that play a lot from Go and Go. Didn't end up working out. Yeah, that was that was impressive. I mean, considering the the unusual movement pattern there to kind of go through the spawn um, and then set up, but they they weren't able to control the area very well. I think having window with that a uh, shorty and and not ever turning away was so important. Mm -hmm. So now it's nine to four. Okay. And we expect a loss here from Prince in the second round, but they've actually they've, they've purchased quite a bit though. Yeah, well they're yeah, buying three heavy. Spectres, two sheriffs. I think they realize that they need to stem the, the flow of points towards Bexu. They're gonna have to have some of the best rounds of their careers right here. So we've got this Viper wall set mm -hmm. up here to basically make the A site that much tinier. And Nox just gets that nice little shot there on a Blebby. Yeah. Cobra just put some damage down as well. Wow, a bit hurt. I like that Cobra just comes right out, tries to peek at that angle he thinks the sheriff shots are coming from. You can fire through this box, so you got to be careful. Ooh, beautifully done. Yeah, among whom with that aim. Now a 4v4. Uh, there are two players creeping up into B. <laughs> The Owl Drone going through. A little bit of a connection there with the Ooh. shuffle. Wow has to back up. Munghoon with some damage on him. Jojo trying to get him. Yeah, Jojo fails at that moment, uh, which means it's just Kosa remaining here. And I mean, Kosa does have the spike, but I don't see this in any way being a victory the next round. Flash coming out. Yeah, oh, Kosa tries blinded. to come up from the top, yeah. and it works for Wow. Oh, man. Okay, Bexu holds on, and that, I mean, it was a pretty pretty deep buy there, right? So they're, I, I think we're going to see go and go buy again, but they're going to be really broke after that. I think so. Bexu right now, 10 to 4, and they, you're right, Artosis, they, they did buy heavy. Go and go Prince did. Considering how little money you have after a lost pistol round. It's, it's a tough situation. Uh, they're just going sheriffs, okay. Sheriff round. Let's see what they yeah. can get done. Kosa got to come in over here. They've got a lot of killjoy utility just scattered all over B. Calmly waiting. Taking their time. 
I think that, yeah, they need to. Kosa needs to be careful. Kosa has not been great in these close duels here, but oh, there's okay, the first there one. A quick execution there on Among Hun. And now to comb the area, scout it out and see if there are more people there. Comes forward, push, pushes in to get that Spectre. Yeah, yeah. I think expertly done. Trailblazer really making the room for that. Banba jumps back from the shock pole. Lebby checking into Garden. Ah, here's the teleporter. Looks like Go and Go definitely planning on going towards A. Yeah, well, they've managed to breach A now. Wow is up here in a very good spot, kind of taking advantage of this uh, poison curtain set up here by the Viper. This wow, though, might get shot there. No, he runs through and Kosa switches sides. Great. Oh, oh didn't no. realize. It needs to be a Nox. It's a Nox or never. Oof. Blebby picks up his third kill, and that's going to be 11 for Tasteless. Is this going to be even more one sided for Bexu than it was for Go and Go on the previous map? Th this is pretty wild, just how much they've reinvented themselves. We're probably going to game three. I think you're right, Tasteless. 11-4 is one of those ones where we just look at each other and nope. We just shake our it's heads. It's not going to happen. Those comebacks, very, very rare from these positions. And, and Go and Go Prince not really in good form on this map so far. No, they're not. They, it doesn't feel like they're playing anywhere near as well, but maybe it's just Bex who's standing up. They're standing up for themselves. They got bullied on Haven. That's right, man. man. Things were rough. Cobra frantically missing over and over yeah. on the recon bolt. My God. Cobra was like flick headshotting everyone with ops and marshals, yeah. and now he can't hit a recon bolt, man. What's happened? It's crazy. All right, JoJo comes forward here. The Killjoy uh, utility is triggered. Yeah, still the alarm bot looks yeah, below the window, but they're going to A, so that everything set up in B not really going to matter as much. Backing up, though. Are they actually going to commit onto this? Looks like they may even try I to turn around and go to, try, go to B. You think so? I think they're going to they're, they're no, try to push here. They've got the toxic screen set up. I mean, they've they've got a lot of tools here, right? Between toxic screen, plus we have seekers ready if need be. Yeah, this Ooh. happens to these Astras, and dude, this is gonna be a 12th win. Wow and Pei are just crushing. Yeah. Again, you can see why Pei that picked Reina. It makes so man. much sense. Well, he had a, he had a weak game on uh, on Haven. Definitely delivering here. Okay, Anox, do you want MVP? Win right here. Bring your team back. <laughs> yeah. Anox just They're chilling. just running the clock here. And they're actually firing through the box here. He peeks out, doesn't see anybody. The angles aren't so good. Even the turret getting in on this. Anox gets a kill there. Kills the turret as well. Turrets. Yeah, the one-way smoke, though, gets him in the end. Wow, goes Well to four. Bexu, so, pretty happy with themselves. Bexu just needs that final blow to kill Gongo Prince off in the second map and bring us into a tied situation in this best of three. Mm -hmm. I really can't believe how well they're playing. By yeah. the way, we're seeing this. You know, this is just a, a feature of, of playing as Astra. It's like these moments where you do set up the Astra stars, you got to come back into the game and get your surroundings again. Yeah. A lot of yeah. moments where you get killed off like that. Definitely the case. I feel like she shouldn't float in the air. She's like showing off. She should sit so that there's less to hit. You know? <laughs> just crouch down. Yeah. Pay gets the first kill Ooh. with a rain and pulls away. Halbe returns the favor to Monghun. Nox trying to come around this corner. Let's see what he can get done. Takes down Pei immediately. Ah, wow, gets him waiting in the U-Haul. Okay, wow. Fires some more shots through there. Halbe very low, comes around, takes down the Owl. Snake bite. Just taking a tad of uh, health off of Bamba. Okay, Halbe may still make this work. Cobra gets the kill there on the WoW. Okay. Just Blebby remaining. You know what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, with Viper's Pit? No, they should they should be fine. Looks like they're going to plant up towards the box corner. Mm -hmm. And this is going to be a fifth win unless 
Blebby is insane. Can you put down lockdown and go clear him? I don't know. You might be able to. <laughs> then again, I mean, you gotta wonder, like, yeah. should you just try your best here and then try to, you know, yeah. they can they can basically save all of their uh, ulties and then just use them all in one round to pretty much guarantee a win. So sure. Helmet gets a yeah. kill there. And, you know, even though it's a long way to go from five to 12 wins, mm -hmm. um, I think right now, Bexu's gotta be smart and basically say, okay, let's just, let's do our best and then we're gonna have one round where we really just pound them. Yeah, that makes that you makes know. perfect sense. I think you're right because you have to win everything from here as as Prince. Yeah, and the problem is is that there's going to be one round where they're all going to have their alties. Mm -hmm. You're probably going to have to save that uh, Hunter's Fury for that. But honestly, you have to do everything in your power to win every round. So right, not leaving anything on the table now. So uh, you know, Go and Go Prince has made the first step. Okay, actually gets that shot off on there, but does. Hold on, we see some hot peeking happening over here. Mm -hmm. now, if Mungan can right click just a few people down, that's pretty much all you need. Some wall spamming there. Doesn't quite connect. All right, look at that. Nice kill there from Mungan, but gets taken down by Anox. And now they're able to dive onto A, or B, excuse me. Jojo moving forward, keeping an eye there on the door. Towards elbow right, right now. Here we Jojo. go. There's that lockdown. But I mean, this is still going to be pretty tough. Mm -hmm. Jojo waiting around the corner. Oh, Cobra with the kill on a Bonma. Jojo, right, takes Jojo down does Blubby. it. Yeah. I mean, this should be a pretty easy win. You can control this from mm -hmm. B long and window if you want. So they start that. Well, they still have a knock, so it definitely it feels like something that they can do. Oh my Dude, god. Dude, they're just going to get the defuse. Yep, they screwed that up. Okay. Uh, clutch wow. okay, victory yeah. there. Uh, gets the uh, defuse and gets the first win for Bexu. That means we're one and one.